question six. We need to work out the time she should get back to Oxford. What we know is that um, she left Oxford. Then travelled for 25 miles to Buckingham. Then from Buckingham she travelled for 45 miles to Reading. Then from Reading she got back to Oxford and uh, the distance travelled was 30. So the total distance altogether is 25 plus 45 plus 30 which is 100 miles. What we do now is that speed equals distance divided by time. This will give us the time it took easy to travel the 100 miles. So it's the distance divided by the speed. So it's 100 divided by the speed and the speed is 50 miles per hour. So it took her two hours <coughs> excuse me to travel the whole distance. Uh, what else we know is um, that she left Oxford at uh, 9 in the morning. So at 9 a.m. she left Oxford and it took her two hours to travel um, all the distance from Oxford and back plus three hours of a meeting she had so plus the three hours so uh, in total it works out from nine o'clock plus the five hours it will work out at 2 p.m. and this is the time she should get back to Oxford by 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Thank you.